Well, Eric, news about the college basketball transfer portal doesn't just affect Louisville and Kentucky. It hit Bellarmine on Thursday in a big way. Yeah, it did. We knew that Dylan Penn, their leading scorer and assist leader from last season, was in the transfer portal, but he'd kind of been taking his time. He'd been showing up at team events, went to the governor's mansion with the team when Governor Bashir honored them. He'd been kind of waiting for an April meeting of the NCAA Division I Council, which was deciding whether to let these reclassifying programs like Bellarmine get to the NCAA tournament after two years instead of four. That decision has been tabled. Bellman for now cannot play in the NCAA tournament next year and Dylan Penn has transferred to Vermont which is awful news for Bellman. I know Scott Davenport wanted to keep him but it's just a reality right now in college basketball. Yeah it, it's a tough thing. I really enjoyed watching Dylan uh, Penn play at a great game in the ASUN tournament um, and, and I get it Vermont is I think 58 they were in one of the computer rankings it's it's up a level in terms of basketball but if he's going there to play in the NCAA tournament might take a time out. I looked at their record over the last 10 years, Vermont has gone to the NCAA tournament three times in 10 years and hasn't won a game. So if that's why you're going, uh, good luck to you. There's no guarantees anywhere. And I hope he didn't walk away from a really good situation at Bellarmine for another opportunity that may not, may not come about. Yeah, you're saying there's a chance. Then, <laughs> there's a chance, go. but a yeah. small one, a smaller one. We'll stay on top of it here and all the other transfer portal news. Just stay with us here at WDRB and WDRB.com.